Mustang Week in Myrtle Beach. Thousands of cars hitting the streets for a number of scheduled events. Our Eric Richards joins us in the studio with a closer look. And you, did you actually get behind the wheel of one? Uh, no, sir. No, you didn't. <laughs> it's okay. a little too expensive for me. <laughs> but I'll tell you what, I did get an opportunity to talk to excited uh, owners and spectators about what's ahead this week. Oh, I love it. I've been coming to Mustang Week for probably close to 10 years now. Mustang Week is back in Myrtle Beach under new ownership. Rodney Melton, who was the previous owner of Mustang Week, he and his staff were like, we're, we're ready to retire and work on our own other businesses that we have. Mm -hmm. And, um, you know, we just couldn't let it just go away. Owners from all over glad to be back as well. Uh, we started off with a, a three liter whipple. We've done uh, ID 1050X injectors. Ten rib kid. Yeah, I've been participating in Mustang Week ever since I was probably like 10 or 12, honestly. I used to come down here with my grandfather that unfortunately passed away. Cars taking to the streets, beware. Horry County PD is there. Jackson Cran, not old enough to drive yet, but has already asked his dad for a Mustang and got this response. He said, um, get a lot of money and I will afford it. In the meantime, a week of events are planned, including an opportunity for owners to hit the track too tough to tame on Thursday. We're going to have a competitive uh, drag racing going on, what we call the, the cruiser drag, the C&D. And that's where people can, you know, win, win the bragging rights. With day one in the books, Jackson is signing off. Jackson WMBF News. Or something like that. <laughs> and as you saw in the uh, piece, Horry County PD was out in force stopping cars whose drivers were a little heavy on the gas pedal. Organizers are reminding everyone to follow the rules of the road, including the speed limit, to avoid any safety issues. And uh, Eric Jackson has uh, probably a TV news career in his future coming for both of our jobs. Over to you. <laughs> I'm definitely nervous. All right.